how to practice Python in 2019. So uh, in this video, we will do a, a Python practice, how to really do Python practice. So you go to coding bat and this is the website codingbat.com and you can see um, I'm logging in. Uh, it's already, you know, just just log into coding bat and you can see um, this Python and Java and all these, you know, yellow stuff. That means you have finished this stuff. You go to Python and for Python, you can see so many warm up one, warm up two, string one, list one, logic two, logic one. You see, so this website is free and it was created. It is maintained by this guy, um, Nick Parlande. Okay. So Nick Parlande, look at this handsome man. This guy is running this, this, uh, uh, website and it's so good website you know quotes wow committees can criticize but they cannot create what a super nerd so this time for sure common phrase among computer programmers and user used to car sales people <laughs> very funny man so he had created this codingbad.com and you know he talks about for example uh, coding practice if you want to build skill in running what do you do you run that's right you do you know so coding bat is just about lots of little problems to provide opportunity to practice so you can practice Python with this website okay so also Java uh, le let's talk about Python here so we'll click on warm-up warm-up one and I'm choosing this sleep in um, you know, you can see already see I have done this. I mean, let's make it big. The parameter weekday is true if it is a weekday and the parameter vacation is true if we are on a vacation. We sleep in if it is not a weekday or we are on vacation. Return true if we sleep in. Okay, that's the question. Uh, sleep in false false should say true. Sleep in true false should say false. Sleep in false true should be true. So I have uh, this is a basic warm up uh, boolean question and I have created this. I have written this uh, function def sleep in weekday vacation if vacation true or weekday is false. So let's click on go. The great thing about this website is that you not only see the solution is correct, but also you see all these tests test runs you know it's like unit tests you can see for this input this is the result r r true uh, and it's okay you know so if we had done something wrong for example let's say I am I'm going to say and instead of or see in these two cases it's wrong so see uh, you, you not only see the result but also you know this tests and the result for that wow that's beautiful so warm up one warm up two you know I'm gonna choose something else maybe uh, logic one and basic boolean logic problems cigar party you know it's a bit more difficult question here so uh, Please guys do this uh, coding bat. It's an amazing website. You can do all this practice for free and you can read these Python helps and Nick Parlande did an amazing job at explaining basic stuff. Also created this website for you guys. Just do it. Okay. Learning by doing learn. Uh, and also you have available Java avail uh, Java is also available. I didn't do this. I should do this. You know, uh, I think it got a little difficult after this. You can see recursion too. I didn't even start that. This is new. I didn't see this before. This is the first time I think I'm seeing this. So yeah, coding bat code practice. Thank you.